Stop. World shit, I've been fucking with the stars, bitch. Stop, boy, come and build shit. Find some fuck shit. Maserati skirt, yeah. Put the point, right? Like my women, 50 shades, no endorsements. World shit, I've been fucking with the stars, bitch. Stop, boy, come and build shit. Find some fuck shit. Maserati skirt, yeah. Put the Welcome back. All 107 possible genders. This is the first episode in the series where we kind of just fuck about and try out some new guns, gain some experience, and of course, possibly, progress some quests. I say possibly because while writing this script, I simply can't seem to remember. Let's find out together, rats. You saw most of these kills like 15 seconds ago, so we're already well on schedule. You're welcome, boys. Those with keen ears have already heard A.I. Allen just round the corner. There he is! And his gaggle of goons just as we rehearsed. Alright, now's just as good of a time as any to let you know I accidentally double-click consumed the moonshine we looted last episode immediately before this raid. Thinking back on it, hmm, not even sure I showed the moonshine. Either way it existed, and continues to exist, within the confines of my blood and liver. Hey! Sticking out his giot for the Rizzler. Got his ass transmogged. I can already hear it, Daddy. Sorry. Zaddy sorry, CRT Drip Lord. What is the ethereal glow? This is a man's sense. It places markers above interactable objects within the map. It saves you time and adds more of a roguelike feel, I think. Less serious, more fun. More passion, more passion, more passion, more energy, more energy, more footwork, more footwork, more footwork, more passion, more energy, more energy. Unfortunately, it's bound to double tap F. So these few raids, I accidentally activate it like 32 times. Sorry. Haha, <laughs> I forgot we had a shovel. Gila. Mm, I can smell the rubles. Some of you are new to the series, so the reason that PMC didn't shoot me is because in my config there's like an 80% chance PMCs of your own faction will be non-hostile until you hurt them or their friends. I just can't be fucked to figure out if either of those conditions are met, so I shoot just about anything that moves. And as displayed here, sometimes even things that don't move. Some call it paranoia, others call it peace of mind. Makes for great gameplay though. Other PMCs become a potential utility as opposed to just another bullet on its way to your face. Just a bit of housekeeping. Behold the glow. Shout out to the boys from Reddit. Some of you are here from the post. I see you.
Another enemy combatant at our one o'clock. That's three dudes total if we're counting the guy heavy breathing in my left ear. Fucking freak. Sounds like a group of special needs individuals. He was a quick one. Reminded me of those gaseous, spider-esque zombies from Kino Der Toten. The boys know what I'm talking about, that's why it's fun. That's why I do it, boys. Holding down the fort, don't want to lose the payload. Aha, the one that got away comes to die. And he has once more eluded me. A swing and a miss. They just can't keep up today, boys. Statistically, I'm at my odds end. Time to pack it up and call it a dub. That's his own fault for getting stuck. You have my full consent to laugh at that. No quests complete, but a bit of cash on hand, and quite a bit of experience, and most importantly, fun. Remember, that's what it's about. Before we continue, let me address a hot-button issue. Yeah, I'm sitting you down like grade school. Right. So, some people are asking, or rather bitching about, why would I ever possibly even remotely consider playing and enjoying a game that Slave Master Battlestate Games believes is the equivalent of a criminal offense? Here's the answer. Lean in close so you don't miss a peep. It's because I paid 135 US dollars for this fucking unoptimized mess and I'll do whatever the fuck I want with it. I want to apologize for that. 98% of you didn't deserve to witness that. It's all love, boys. Love and mental handicaps. Let's lock in rats. Time to do some shooting. Bag up, bag up. Bag up, Terry. Put it in reverse, Terry. Put it in reverse. Oh, Lord. Lord, Jesus. Oh, Lord! Oh, Steve! What the what, what you doing, Terry? Terry, what's up? What? As expected, we were past due for a death. Moving on, boys. We're gonna run through customs quick. Why not, you know? Rats, look at this. Shit's gotta weigh a ton. Yoink! All I see is Benny's baby.
Honestly, not much to show here. We kind of made a clean getaway. Just in and out, a good run, no doubt. Been a while since we lurked in the shadows. We've already got some cash on us, but a pair of NVGs never hurt nobody. A freebie. Gotta take them when you see them. For those who've made it this far, there's a Discord link in the description. All rats welcome. Feel free to drop into the suggestions channel and recommend a topic or game deserving of a channel. Not bad. Here's the loots after juice room and med room. Seeing the moon shine, I'm no longer sure it was last raid that happened. Maybe I switched the two up. Crack house first, then straight to extract. And we made it, as always, let's claim our cash and check the stats. Thanks for watching, rats. I appreciate you. Here's the bands and the ratios. Until next time. Rack City, yeah, I'm coming like a tug of dust. Bag of pay for the man that's fucking under us. No pause break, global fucking all stay. Hey, hey, hey. in that windy when I come through. Icy D rolls with the 50, no shade. I'll be focused on my health shit. No side bitch, man, I'm focused on my health shit. When I'm all up in the limelight, roses on my nightstand shit.